What's up, y'all? Toasted Ted here once again. Welcome back to Zombie Defense. This will be uh, part three of the tutorial. If you didn't see the first two parts, uh, they're part of a playlist back in my channel you can go check out. Um, this one, I kind of made three separate videos and I had to splice them together, kind of. So um, there's a couple different cuts where it like, goes to black for a second, but that's why. But uh, anyway, um, if you like the video, give it a like and um, stay tuned for more. Anyway. Here we go. What's up, y'all? Toasted Ted here once again. This will be uh, part three of the tutorial and probably the final part. Um, as you can see by the menu there, there's a get money and free money. Um, I believe get money, you have to download an app and like, get to a certain level and it gives you a bunch of money. And free money... Um, you just watch an ad and it gives you a couple hundred or whatever. But um, obviously you have to have a data connection for that to work, but the game itself doesn't require one. Um, here, I'll show you the upgrade system. As you can see, I've gotten all the upgrades for green and gold, or regular and gold, if you will. And premium, I have five left to get. And I think the five I have left to get, you have to actually buy. Uh, maybe not. Huh. I don't know which five are in here that I don't have yet. Weird. Anyway. Maybe it's this. I don't know. Um. Anyway, yeah. There's a... Uh, Three levels of upgrades, like uh, these are all like the basic upgrades, you know, like your trapper, you upgrade them once, they'll have a uh, survivalist, you know, stuff like that, or you get dynamite and then you get dynamite too, but if you go the other direction, you unlock the survivalist, which is the, it's kind of like the sheriff, but he's got grenades. Same thing like up here, you know, the protection 50% slot rank two and then you like it webs off from there but as you can see there's a lot of different upgrades to buy 120 of them as it said in the other menu um i'm going to show you the gold ones i guess and i'll show you all the different missions but yeah then there's all these that aren't for uh, weapons or anything but like here's where you buy your drones your drone damage you know upgrade your drone damage um upgrade your health and stuff like that so gold is where like you upgrade more permanent up upgrades in terms of um, uh, like your units and stuff. And then regular is more weapons and like different, up different units instead of upgrading those units, which obviously these have upgrades too, but um, here I'll show you the play. There's regular nightmare, which regular I just showed you in the, in the, tutorial nightmare is the same basically but way uh, more difficult same as regular but just harder three-man challenge means you only get three units to use not including the drones and stuff like that like you can have your three units out and then buy three drones also because the drones don't count tv challenge there's a cameraman that is basically supposedly filming and you just have to protect him and make sure he doesn't die Boss challenge, I haven't done too many of, but apparently it's pretty much just, just bosses, I guess. I don't know. Zombie boss will appear in every wave. Yeah, every single wave instead of every five waves or every ten waves or whatever the level dictates. But anyway, going to regular here. I'm going to show you all these different maps. No, I mean, wow. There is a lot of missions. Some of them I haven't even beaten yet on hard. I've beaten them all on this one before. You know, I've gotten to the goal at least, but like, see how it says three star and like some of them say two or, you know, one. Um, that means you got to the goal and then advanced two more levels after the goal and kept going. But uh, see how it says 3D with the check mark, you can turn that off. So it's just like a normal, like this. But, um, yeah, that's pretty much it for the um, tutorial. And uh, I don't know, I hope you guys try this game because it's a lot of fun.
Uh, one more thing I forgot to add is that um, while you're playing this game, like in level, here, um, I'll, I'll just start this I, this one for you real quick just to show you what I mean. You can um, move the spots. Like if the spot isn't exactly where you want it, like, oh, like for instance, okay, right here, summon this guy, summon that guy on a green one, and he's just regular. This spot is already yellow. Summon the same guy on there, and now he's got a little like mark above his head. That means he's leveled up once. I'll take that guy back there, upgrade his spot. So now they're both like that. Which upgrading for that unit is the cheapest unit in the game, and upgrading his uh, level is the cheapest you can do. But, uh, you know, stuff like that. But anyway, yeah, if you pick one of these empty spots, see the 300 one on the very bottom with the arrows? That means you can move it. Like, oh, I don't want to get where it is. I'm going to put it over there, and then, oh, no, I want it over there now. You know what I mean? As long as it's empty, you can move it anywhere you want. But anyway, um, that's pretty much all I wanted to add. I'm not too sure what this thing is up here. Reduce all unit damage by 50. Oh. You can buy the, what? Oh, okay, this is the online pay shop stuff. That's why I haven't unlocked it. That makes sense. Anyway, um, yeah, that's pretty much all I wanted to say. It's uh, pretty sure it's the only thing I haven't note mentioned. Or no, here, I'll do this too. Buy a supply drop. Now that unit has um, all those different things. And because he has those, you can throw them now. <laughs> throw a Maltov there, and the zombies won't go where the Maltov is. Like, they won't go where the fire is. So if you block their spot, block their entry with fire, they'll have to walk around it, which makes them walk slower and take longer, so they get hit by more bullets. So by the time they reach you, they're not dead, or you're not dead. Um, but yeah, anyway, that's pretty much it. I'll uh, see you in the next one. Thank you for watching part three for my tutorial on zombie defense. Um, I hope this uh, video was informative and I hope you give the game a try because it's a lot of fun uh, and it's free, so you might as well. But um, anyway, if you did like the video, give it a like, comment down below whether or not you've tried it and uh, what you use for units and uh, subscribe if you haven't. Anyway, I'll catch you in the next one. This is Toasted Ted and I'm out.